Hello everybody, it's Glitter Informer making a rare video between episode reviews. I've mentioned the official Hero Garu Sky Pretty Cure website multiple times in my reviews, and I even made a whole video dedicated to looking at it before the show started airing. In that video, I mostly focused on the section of the site where they have information about the characters in the show. But did you know that they updated the site with more characters? In this video, we'll be looking at those characters. I'll be translating as much as I can, but keep in mind that I'm not fluent in Japanese, so I might make some mistakes. If you catch any mistakes, please leave a comment pointing them out. Just like before, we have our four main Pretty Cures under the Pretty Cure section, and L under the Skyland section. Also, Cure Wing and Cure Butterfly still don't have any listed voice actors, paragraphs summing up their personalities, or art of their civilian forms, unlike Cure Sky and Cure Prism. But now, there are two new sections. Our first new section is Supporting Characters, containing Agaha Hijiri and Yoyo Nijigaoka. It is interesting that Agaha is in the Supporting Characters section instead of the Pretty Cure section since, as I said in the episode 4 review, it's as clear as can be that she's going to become Cure Butterfly. Not only do they have similar hair and the same theme color, but the site lists Agaha's voice actor as Ayaka Nanase. An interview with the director of the series confirmed that Cure Butterfly's voice actor would be, you guessed it, Ayaka Nanase. Toei's trying to hide Cure Butterfly's secret identity, but it's futile. This is the site's bio for Agaha. Mashiro's childhood friend who will always go all out immediately getting along with anyone. A cheerful and reliable older sister figure who loves fashion and fun things. Aiming to become a nursery school teacher, she came to Sorashido City in order to attend its vocational school. The other supporting character is Yoyo Nijigaoka. Her voice actor is Tomoko Shiota, and her bio is Mashiro's grandmother, who has all sorts of knowledge and is well informed. As a matter of fact, she's a hyper amazing legendary scholar who came from Skyland. It's kind of odd that she's not listed under the Skyland section since that's where she came from. I guess she's been on Earth long enough that she's just one of us now. Our final section is Underg, short for the Underg Empire, which is the name of our villain group. So far, the only characters in this section are Kabatone and the Ronborgs. Kabatone's voice actor is Yasuhiro Mamiya. Fun fact, this voice actor has had a role in the franchise before. In 2018's Hugto Pretty Cure, he voiced the lead Cure's dad. Kabatone's bio reads, a hooligan from the Underg Empire, believes that might makes right. His catchphrase is, I'm tough! Apologies, I'm not a good voice actor. Finally, all of the Ronborgs get a single shared character slot to themselves. The image only shows the Ronborgs from the first three episodes. It would be nice to see pictures of all of the Ronborgs, but I understand from experience that drawing takes time. Unfortunately, there is no voice actor listed for the Ronborgs. This is a huge shame because voice acting is a really difficult and demanding job and those who do it deserve to be credited. Fortunately, we do know that the voice actor of the Ronborgs is, in fact, Koichi Soma because Toei had the good sense to list him in the credits during the ending theme. The Ronborg's bio says, Under energy possessed objects that become self-centered violent monsters. So, that's it for the site. I hope that this video wasn't too terribly boring, and I look forward to seeing you all again for episode 7.